This is WCPO 9 News. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Tanya O'Rourke. Here's a look at some of today's top stories. A crash in College Hill sends three people to the hospital. It happened at the corner of North Bend Road in Faircrest. Police say a man was thrown from the brown SUV. And when firefighters got to the scene, the blue car was on fire. Three people were taken to the hospital. They do not have life threatening injuries. Time's running out for some college students and staff to get their COVID-19 shot. At the University of Cincinnati, OU and OSU, everyone must be fully vaccinated by Monday. If students are not, they won't be able to register or they'll be drawn from spring classes unless they have an exemption. Miami's vaccination deadline is November 22nd. Xavier's is January 3rd. A woman is dead after she was hit by a vehicle in a grocery store parking lot. Police say a man in a pickup truck hit that woman outside Kroger in Colerain Township yesterday. The driver called 911 and stayed on the scene. Police are still investigating. They have not identified the victim. Let's get a check of this chilly forecast. Here's Chief Meteorologist Steve Raleigh. Okay, Tanya, as we take it for you, uh, we've got ourselves clouds and some showers really right through the rest of the night. Overnight, temperatures will be dropping near freezing, 32 in Cincinnati. So we're going to have a chance of a little mix late overnight, early into tomorrow, maybe a couple of flurries. Our Saturday then, as we break it out, we're generally going to be mostly cloudy with temperatures making it to the lower 40s. Then on Sunday, a little different. Little slug of moisture is around here first thing, and I think the possibility of a little rain snow snow or perhaps just a few snow showers are possible, but the temperatures climb to the 40s, so we're talking about rain later. My nine day forecast shows how it's going to stay winter like right through Monday, and then the temperatures start rebounding next week.